16. Federal lawmakers in the upper chamber set aside two legislative days to amend and pass the Nigerian Customs Service Management Act 2017. In the new amendment, the Senate has scrapped the governing board of the Nigerian Customs Service, replacing it with the Nigerian Customs Commission. The governing board is headed by the Minister of Finance, who oversees the activities of the service. The commission would now be headed by a chairman who shall be appointed by the president, but subject to the confirmation of the Senate. The new regime prescribes the use of pre-shipment and post-shipment inspection, meaning all ships and vessels coming into Nigeria must be thoroughly inspected from the country of origin to the port of destination. The Nigeria Customs Service would, however, be required to outsource the technology needed for effective inspection. The realities on ground. Recall that for the past 35 years, the Customs and Exercise Management Act has never been amended. This is the first time in so many years that this law is passing through an amendment. The bill contains 16 penal clauses, one of which recommends various punishments from dismissal to imprisonment for customs officers who violate the provisions. Senate President Bukola Saraki says the amendment of the bill will bring the much needed reforms to the Nigeria Customs Service. I think it's a very, very positive development in ensuring that we have a, a, a custom administration that will be more transparent, better clarity, and also the reference to National Assembly on issue of duty reviews will also make the process more transparent and people will be able to participate more. Meanwhile, the Senate has condemned the alleged rape and killings of two women in Edo State by suspected herdsmen. Senator Clifford Odia informed lawmakers of the killings and asked the Senate to intervene. The Senate decided that on the 22nd day of May 2017, these ravaging Wahes men entered into farmland located at Ewo community. It's our central local government of Edo State, raping two women, Mrs. Martina Emoyo and Mrs. Ariu, and struggled them to death, destroyed crops and sack a number of a lot of persons oh, at yeah. Edo's farmland. The Senate asked security agencies to apprehend the perpetrators of the attack yeah. and also arrest those who disguise as headsmen to unleash violence.